Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to another one of my uh, Tradition Wet Shaving videos. Uh, this is uh, Sean speaking and um, welcome back. Greetings. And uh, today I'm going to um, feature a product that uh, I'm looking uh, so forward to uh, trying out for the first time. It will be this. From uh, the excellent people from uh, Henri et Victoria based in uh, Quebec. Uh, Cognac and Cuban cigars. Yes, uh, this, this is a triple milled soap. Wow, this uh, smells incredible. Uh, hints of uh, tobacco, lemon. Um, yeah, just amazing. It smells very fresh. And um, for the aftershave, it'd be most appropriate if I use uh, the Cognac in uh, Cuban cigars. Uh, aftershave balm from the uh, same brand and um, the razor that I'll be uh, using today will be uh, this it's the Parker 91 and it's equipped with one of these a Gillette uh, 7 o'clock super stainless blade and um, I actually bought um, the uh, triple milled shaving soap and uh, aftershave from uh, the, the official Henri et Victoria website. And, uh, yep. And I would just like to say um, thank you for, thank you, Claude, uh, Mr. Pilon, for um, signing my receipt. Yes. Um, and as well, I bought one of these the uh, Yaki brush, which I'll feature in my uh, video as well. Okay, so. I'll go ahead and uh, get started with the uh, lathering and uh, we'll be good to go. Yes, well, this looks uh, very large and thick. Yes, this uh, brush here really absorbs a lot of water. Seems to be uh, generating a good lather here. Yeah, the one nice thing about uh, triple milled soap is that it's much uh, creamier and lasts so much longer than uh, the regular kind of a shaving soap. Maybe I'll just add a little bit of water here. just to get a good enough, rich enough lather. Okay, I think it's good enough right here. And I'll just uh, work it through my face. Mm-hmm. Yes, triple milled soap has very nice texture. Nice and creamy. Goes on, applies to the face so smooth. Yes. 
Yes, this is very neat here, the uh, barber pole design. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, this brush w wasn't too expensive either. It was uh, only uh, $34 Canadian on their uh, website. And uh, seeing how it's performing here, I think that's a pretty good deal. Smell here makes me think as if I'm walking into a cigar shop. All right. Oh, maybe just a little bit more. Okay, that's good. I'll start off uh, with the uh, first pass going with the grain. Yeah, nice and slick. Yes, um, as I would have expected, this uh, soap is providing excellent protection for my uh, skin. And the scent is so uh, clean and refreshing. Yeah, nice. Very masculine. This uh, scent ma makes me uh, think as if I'm being uh, being part of a uh, of an elite gentleman's club in uh, downtown Montreal. Yeah. Very nice. Yes, and this uh, particular razor here is uh, considered to be fairly aggressive. Uh, so far, I don't uh, notice any uh, irritation on my skin.
Now the other kind of a triple milled soap uh, you can buy from this particular brand is the uh, Duke de Santal, which I have uh, already featured in a previous video. And that was pretty amazing. Yes. Yes, um, this uh, particular scent right here also uh, uh, has uh, the scent of cedar wood included into it. There, there we go. Nice job for the first pass. Um, it's what I expect from a triple milled sha shaving soap. So I'll go ahead and uh, lather it for the second pass. Mm. Yeah, I lo love how this uh, brush covers a lot of area to the face. Make sure the uh, leather uh, gets really applied to the skin. There we go. Okay, so the second press cross green. Yes, so um, for those of you who are not familiar, familiar with this uh, particular brand, they were founded in uh, 2014 by uh, Claude Pilon, who's a uh, biochemist. And uh, he wanted to uh, introduce a uh, chain which uh, did not include all the uh, chemical abrasives that you would find in a traditional uh, pharmacy type uh, shaving gels and creams and foams. Yes, he wanted to uh, bring forth products which uh, were vegan and cruelty free. Well, just to let you know, I'm a vegan uh, myself and um, I uh, totally against animal cruelty, so if uh, there's a product that uh, does not have that uh, cruelty-free symbol, I will not buy it. Feels as if um, with 
with this particular uh, shaving soap. It feels as if I'm uh, staying at a five-star resort in the Caribbean. Now, I myself have been to the Caribbean, but um, only to the Dominican Republic. That was quite a while ago, back in 2012. But yeah, this uh, shaving soap is starting to bring back those memories for me. Yeah. Which uh, was an amazing time. It was the week just before Christmas. And it was an excellent way to spend my uh, holidays. And of course, uh, I forgot to mention uh, this uh, soap right here contains uh, hints of cognac wine. Hence the name cognac and Cuban cigars. All right, amazing. Yeah, so nice and slick, smooth, but uh, I want to achieve a uh, baby smooth uh, feel to my cheeks, so that's why I'm going to go against the grain for the third pass. So, uh, wherever you are, hope you're doing well, taking good care of yourself during these challenging times, staying safe, Third and final pass against the grain. Yeah, so triple milled shaving soap. 
it uh, removes any uh, excess water from uh, the manufacturing process. Which leads to uh, an even higher quality product. Now, I have no intention of uh, taking up smoking, never have, never will, but uh, this is the closest that I will come to doing that. At least the, this particular product doesn't have uh, the addict, addictive properties that you would find in cigarettes and actual cigars. But yeah, I do actually feel a bit classier shaving with this. It has a very uplifting, masculine, mature scent. For the, sophist for the sophisticated gentleman. Okay, just do a last minute check.
Okay, I think we're done. Yeah. Looking great. Fabulous. Right. Yeah, very nice and smooth. Yeah. I'm very impressed. Triple mold uh, shaving soap certainly uh, does uh, wonders for uh, the skin, I must say. There. Yes, amazing. Now, I'll. Time to try out this uh, aftershave. Just uh, have to make sure to work it into uh, the pores of the face. There, we have a winner. Excellent. Amazing stuff. All right, so, um, just to recap what was used for this video, the uh, Henri et Victoria Cognac in Cuban Cigars Triple Milled Shaving Soap. Great stuff. I highly recommend it. And uh, the uh, Henri et Victoria Cognac in Cuban Cigars uh, Aftershave Bomb. Yep. Impressive stuff. And uh, a Yaki brush that uh, I bought from uh, the Henri et Victoria official site. Yeah, blathers well. Uh, it's large enough uh, to formulate a good lather and uh, gather enough uh, soap content. Yep, yeah, I'm very impressed with this. I'll keep using this for all my, uh, for many of my uh, future uh, shavings. And uh, the Parker, 91 razor equipped with a fresh uh, Gillette seven o'clock super stainless blade. Okay, so um, that's it. Um, I do want to uh, thank um, Ari and Victoria for uh, pr producing a, such a, an amazing product. Uh, I think uh, triple milled uh, shaving soaps uh, are uh, better for the face uh, than uh, the regular um, shaving soaps. Um, I encourage uh, any uh, wet shaver to uh, try these products out. 
and um, just uh, enjoy. Yep, so that's it. Um, this is uh, Sean. Um, I hope you have a, a wonderful day wherever you are. Um, stay safe. Enjoy great shaves. And I'll just uh, clo close by uh, saying uh, peace, much love, and namaste. All right, everyone. Uh, have a wonderful day. Take care. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Bye.